He's going to kick the corruption out the door and we're going to put people into that municipality who work for you. Work for you. Because you are the most important people in a democracy. So, the sky is blue. The DA is blue. On the 1st of November, we're going to vote the ANC out. On the 1st of November, we're going to vote the DA in. The sky is blue. The DA is Blue. On the 1st of November, we're going to vote the ANC out. On the 1st of November, we're going to vote Bosman in. And that's what we're going to do to change things here. But you know, I've been speaking to so many people in the audience. I've been speaking to people on the ground here. The big problem here is jobs. People want jobs. That's what the people want here. But you're not going to get jobs here with a municipality that can't keep the lights on, can't keep the electricity on, can't keep the water on, and are chasing the business away. You're not going to get jobs here when the municipality is full of corruption. It's like those bed bugs. You know the ones that sit in your bed, the bed lice. And when you're sleeping at night, they suck your blood. They suck your That's what the ANC have become, a parasite that suck off the citizens of our country every day. They suck your blood and they give nothing back. Now, a lace converse, a last blanket, you can't put it in the washing machine and think it's better because that lace are still in there. They still sit in there. You can't take that blanket out there and you can't hang it up on the... Thanks. You can't hang it up on the washing line and think that the lice are going to go. There's only one way you get rid of a lice blanket. You take it outside and you burn it. You burn it. And that's how we've got to get rid of the parasites in this municipality. We've got to vote them out on the 1st of November so we can get a decent government in place. Isn't that what you want? Who wants the ANC back? So you can, we've got to go out and make sure that people understand that if you waste your vote on these small parties, you're going to let the ANC in through the back door. You know the people who come in the back door and they steal your things? The ANC will come through the back door if we let these small parties, small and yana parties, box and bender parties come and they eat the votes. They'll let the ANC back in. Every municipality in this country has got a choice. They're either going to wake up on the 2nd of November with a DA municipality, or they're going to have an ANC municipality. Who wants an ANC municipality? Who wants a DA municipality? Yeah. That's what we want. So we can bring change here and make your lives better. That we can build a future for your families. That we can bring jobs and industry and development here so that your children have a chance of building a better life than the one you've had to live. We want to bring water here. Not promising water. We're going to bring water here. We're going to bring services here. We're going to spend the money on you and not on the politicians. So Democrats, I need you to do me a favor. Because coming here today, you've said that you are committed. But we've got this final push now to get out there and get people to come and vote. And people are interested. I saw there were people from another political party here earlier. We welcome them. It's always better where the DA is. Isn't that right? Even the president, even the president knows that the DA gets things done. Even the president knows where the, where the DA is, life is better. He built himself a huge mansion, a big, big house in Cape Town. He didn't put it in Johannesburg. He didn't put it in Buffalo City. He didn't put it in Malashleni. He built it in DA-run Cape Town because even he knows the DA gets things done. And so, Democrats, I need you to go out and work really hard over the next two weeks. We've got two weeks to go and get the votes in so we can have a majority in Steve Chwete. When we have that majority, we can start to change things for the better. And so, many of you know, they call me, John Vuligate. Yeah. You know that song? John Vuligate. Nancy Stogo. 
John Bulligan and Nancy Stoll. Well, let me tell you, on the 1st of November, I'm going to be John Vuli Manzi, John Vuli Pompo, John Vuli Kaya, John Vuli Msebenzi. And together, we're going to Vula and Steve Trete municipality. We're going to Vula that gate and put Bosman in there. We're going to Vula the gate and put a DA government in there. And we're going to Vula the gate for all of you to have a better future. Because the DA... Gets things done. The DA gets things done. So let's get out there and vula that gate on the 1st of November, Democrats. I love you all. Let's go and work. Let's make the change. Let's get it done. Thank you.